Well, hello, lovely people. It is the weekend, which means it's honeydew time because it's summertime and I'm not on the road right now, which is great. I travel so much in the summer, it's crazy. And there have been so many storms lately here in San Antonio that our yard has just kind of started to be overgrown a little bit. Check this out, this is nuts. So like our bushes and hedges and everything are just kind of getting out of hand. I haven't had a hedge trimmer since we lived in Houston like 12 years ago. Uh, and so I'm gonna go pick one of those up today and get to work. The boys and I are gonna have a work day here in the yard. We're gonna mow, we're gonna trim, we're gonna do all the good stuff and uh, just try to get our curb appeal back on our brand new house, you know? So, should be a good day. Pretty excited. <laughs> Here's my aisle. Here's what I'm thinking, right here. Looks about right. I guess thing. That's the one I want to go with. Snag that guy. Alright. We have not uh, used this mower since we moved in. And uh, so it's still packed up, basically. So we're gonna set it up, and uh, I wanna teach this guy how to mow. <laughs> I started mowing when I was eight years old. My dad taught me how to mow. I would mow our yard, and actually that was my first job. I started a lawn care business that I would go around to all the houses in the neighborhood, and I would ask for them if I could mow their yard for $20. And actually made some pretty good money at a pretty young age. Uh, helped take care of my family a little bit um, in that way. And uh, so I'm not gonna be asking Jude to take care of the family necessarily, but it's time for him to learn to mow, I think. <laughs> Are you excited about learning to use the mower? Kind of, I guess. <laughs> um, he wants to, but I don't know. All right, so we have the mower ready to roll. Okay, so Jude, what you're gonna do is just give this a little pull right here. That gives gas to the thing. And then you're gonna grab this still right here and just crank it as hard as you can. Pull! 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 <laughs> it's kinda hard, huh? Dude, I have spent an hour sometimes trying to get it started after the first of the year. It's insane. Let me give it a shot, okay? Okay guys, so the first thing you do whenever you mow is you check the yard to make sure there are no rocks, big sticks, right? Move that out of the way so you don't tear that up, tear up the mower, tear up the blade. So I'm gonna show you how. I'll, I'll do one and then you go, okay? He just killed the engine already. Your turn, buddy. You give it a shot. I'm just saying a straight line, okay? Straight line all the way. A little harder than it looks, huh? <laughs> so then you just rake up the grass because we don't want it killing the other grass. So while they're doing that, Kira asked if she could make a little bit of money washing the cars. So she is doing that and doing a great job, might I add. <laughs> it's a hot day today. Mm -hmm. Kind of feels good in the water. Huh? Yeah, it does. <laughs> Thanks for doing that, kiddo. Mm -hmm. and I am going to start working on this guy. Guys, the struggle is real. Doesn't matter how many times you roll these suckers up the right way, somehow, this is how they end up. Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> I'm a little sad about having to trim this sucker up because so much of this is like really pretty purple flowers. But it's kind of hindering the walkway. You know, you can't really get through. Watch this. Liam can barely fit through our, through our sidewalk. That's when you know it's getting out of hand. So, sorry beautiful purple flowers. We're gonna have to see you go. Y'all wanna shed a couple of tears? <laughs> There's a bee! There's a bee! There's a bee. Oh Again, God. another reason. So we're not gonna go crazy. We're just gonna kind of trim it lightly so we can walk by, keep that lush look. It's just kind of a... You know how to use that thing. <laughs> We're raking her up, bagging it up. Great job, dude. Great job, my man. You can actually see, you can actually walk. It's kind of amazing, we're almost done. Okay, no longer a maze. It looks like it's going to devour all of our guests when they come in. Great work, amigos. Thank you. Lincoln, did you come help too, buddy? Oh my <laughs> goodness gracious, you're a goober. I love it. <laughs> yeah. Ah, it's pretty hot today, huh? You know, we need to go take a shower, we're all kind of stinky and sweaty, huh? All right, good job, guys. High five. Boom. Oh, oh, thanks, Lincoln. <laughs> there you go, Jude. <Hi>. Pow. <laughs> I love you guys. Thanks for helping. And Kira cleaned the vehicles like a rock star, and they look amazing. They're so hot. I know, man. Oh, yeah, I'm tired. Yeah. Oh, gosh, it's so hot. Let's go inside in the air conditioning. Aren't you guys happy and excited and thankful for air conditioning? Me too. Okay, well I'm feeling pretty good. I got a shower, nice trim up on my beard, and uh, if you notice because it's a little bit shorter than it was like two minutes ago in this video. <laughs> but uh, a buddy of mine opened a restaurant here in town called Cabo Bob's, and Amanda and Lincoln are tagging along with me to do a little food review for them. And so I'm pretty excited. This is actually our, like our favorite place in Austin. So, so uh, good. we're really pumped. You probably have seen them on some of our previous videos actually. Yeah, I think um, so. And so we're really excited to have a location just down the road from us. So Bye. coming in to do some photos for these guys and uh, pretty excited about it. So let's go. Are you ready for some Tex-Mex, buddy? Yeah. Like, did you say food? Did you say Tex-Mex? Yeah. Did you say tacos? Lincoln. Hey. So I'm hungry. Mom. Yeah, you got a sippy cup, don't you? That's a cool one with the straw. Mom. It's like, where's the food? I'm ready. You guys are so excited to be here. Cobble Balls is one of our favorite places and some of our friends uh, work here and so we're super, Mom. super excited. Mom. What are you doing? He's just scooting all over the place. <laughs> Where are you going? Upside down. Whoa. Oh, careful. Careful. Come here. <laughs> High five. No, come back. Come back. <laughs> the best fish tacos in the world. The best on the planet. Very, very good. No better fish tacos. The very best fish tacos. Yeah. Lincoln what agrees. Say yes, they're so good. Yeah. So good. They're so good. <laughs> so happy right now. Mm. So good. Ah. 
Oh, thank you, buddy. Appreciate it. Oh, you go. There you go. Hey, guys. Did you guys have fun with Reese and Kira and Penelope? We have some food for you guys. We have Cabo Bob's. You want some tacos? I just you still have your swimsuit on, Goober. I snuck. You snuck. What did you sneak? What did you sneak? <laughs> did you sneak ice cream? Hmm? It was ice cream. It was ice cream. Ice cream cake. We had ice cream cake yesterday for my birthday, right? Yep. Which was really, really good. And Ethan keeps trying to get into it. You little stinker. You were not supposed to sneak. Hey. What do you think you should say to me for sneaking the ice cream cake? Sorry. Say, I won't sneak anymore. I won't sneak anymore. Okay. Let's go eat some tacos, guys. Yum. It's Taco Tuesday. Taco Tuesday? Say, I love tacos. Who is that? <laughs> See, Daddy took Lincoln in. He's waiting for us. He's like, come on, guys. You're taking too long. Hey, buddy. We were coming, too. All right, we are back home. I have a lot of food left over. Yeah, the kids are all eating. <laughs> what did you guys say to Daddy for bringing the leftovers? Thank oh. you! <laughs> really good, isn't it? Okay. The girls are babysitting you. Be good. Be sweet to Lincoln, okay? Bye, Lincoln. Bye bye. Love you, buddy. Bye, girls. Have a good time. We'll see you in a little bit. Love you. Okay, guys, so Steven and I are going to see a movie because yesterday was actually my birthday and um, it's been a super busy, crazy season, and so I asked Steven and the kids to just give me a super chill day at home yesterday where I could sleep in and we could just enjoy being together and not work, not vlog, or any of that. And so um, that's what we did, and I really appreciate it. But um, we're going out for a date tonight, and so um, yeah, we're gonna see a movie. But thanks for watching, guys, and if you're new here, we'd love for you to stick around and subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. See you. Bye.